Yo, what's good, YouTube? What's good? What's hood, man? Hey, today I just got a quick little video, man. I just thought I'd turn the camera on and talk my shit, you know what I'm saying? Kick my pimping. But look, man, today, you know, man, I like it right there. Listen, today, man, I'm finna be talking about life, man. Life is a marathon, man. It's not a race, okay? Like, y'all really gotta understand it. All, all my young boys, bro, life is a marathon. It is not a race. You, you get me? What do I mean by that? So, especially as a man, you have to build yourself up, bro. And the things that make you attractive as a man take time, man. It takes it takes so long, bro. Like, and, and it's okay. The thing is, a lot of young boys, man, they they get they get angry or they, they get worried or anxious or sometimes they feel self-conscious or they, they feel depressed because they're not where they want to be. But the thing is, bro, what you want or, you know what I'm saying, a, a man's um, prom, it takes time, bro. Because for a man to be attractive, he has to have a bunch of things in order. And it takes time to acquire, you know what I'm saying? Money on point, having a good job, having confidence, being ambitious, uh having his own shit, having his own crib, um, you know, going, having been through trials and tribulations, but, you know, he's a confident, assertive, dominant man. Um, you know what I mean? All, all these different things, you know, experience with women, all these different things, man, take time to acquire. You know what I'm saying? Like a man's prime really isn't until like his thirties, man. Like, and if you're lucky, your twenties, and that's if you're lucky, like, but bruh, most dudes don't hit their prime till they're about 30, 40. So the thing is, man, don't don't be discouraged if you're not where you want to be right now. You know what I'm saying? As long as you're working towards it and you're you're grinding, you're not wasting time doing dumb shit. Now I'm not saying don't have fun. You don't have to completely not hang out with your friends or not go out at all in your 20s. Like definitely have fun, but you know what you have to prioritize. Like you can you can still make time to hang out with your friends or party or you know what I'm saying, or fuck with some bitches here and there, but it has to be a balance. It should, like, the majority of your time should be spent making money, getting in better shape, looking more attractive, being in the gym. That's another thing I, I forgot to mention. As a man, you're not going to hit your prime physique till you're, like, late 20s, 30s, early 30s. So everything that makes you attractive definitely takes time, bro. But, um, yeah, man, just as long as, you you know, you're, you're working towards something, you're good, bro. Don't even stress. Don't stress. Don't stress if you're not where you want to be. But the thing is, you got to put the work in. You know what I'm saying? You can't <clears throat> you can't complain or you can't think that it's just going to happen. I don't know when, no, you have to put the work in, bro. Like, shit isn't just going to come to you as a man. You have to go out and get it. So you have to go out and, you know what I'm saying? You got to work out damn near every single day. You have to purposely, you know, look for different jobs. See what, see what works, see what doesn't work. Go out, maybe go the entrepreneur route. Seeing how to make money, you know, striking out with girls, you know what I'm saying? Getting your confidence up, um, going through different trials and tribulations. So as a man, you like in your 20s, bro, and you're, if I don't know how old y'all niggas are, but if you in your teens to 20s, that's grind time, bro. That's prime grind time, bro. You got, you, listen, bro, when you in your teens and your 20s, you got so much energy, so much free time, bro. You ain't doing shit, bro. You ain't doing shit. Stop wasting your fucking time. And go grind, get some money. Like, what do y'all like, bro? It's so, bro. And the thing is, as much as motherfuckers want to complain about dating in 2024, well, it's 2023 now. It's about to be 2024. I don't know when, when I'm going to post this video. It might be 2024 when I post this video. I don't fucking know. But everybody want to complain about, you know, the dating market now, what times is getting weird now. But, bro, in 2023, today, when I'm recording this video, December 2023, it is so many ways to make money. It's not even funny. So if you are broke in 2023, you are, I don't know what you're doing. Like you literally must be sitting home jacking off the, I don't know. I, I literally have no idea what you're doing. There's so many ways to make money in 2023, bro. Get off your ass and make that bread, bro. Like, come on, man. Y'all letting these girls out earn you. Y'all letting these females <laughs> run laps around y'all niggas. Y'all need to step up. Y'all need to start acting like men. You get what I'm saying? <sighs> bro, Listen. In your teens and your 20s, you need to be grinding. You feel me? You need to be grinding, bruh. Like, 
You need like constantly, bro. You got so much energy and shit. You need to be working out in a gym, grinding, trying to make money, have working a job, doing you know having a side job or or trying to make money with your own business. Maybe you selling clothes. Maybe you, whatever the fuck. Do something. You get what I'm saying? This is the time to 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 try different things and fail. And it's, that's the, that's another thing I wanted to say. It's okay to fail. Like, bro, in your teens and your twenties, this is the time to fail. You know what I'm saying? When you don't have any kids. When you don't have any commitments, you don't have like you don't have any even well even if you do have kids at a young age, this is still time to grind. But especially for all my young boys who don't have no kids, no nothing, no commitment, you need to be going crazy, bro. You need to be figuring out, you know, what I'm saying what works, what doesn't work. You need to be you need to be carving your path, your life path. That's what that's what you need to be doing right now, bro. Carving your life path, and it's okay if you don't have it all figured out. Nobody does. Like when you in your teens and your twenties, nobody does, bro. Like everybody just. Seeing, seeing what what works for them and who they, they're trying to find themselves. And that's okay. But you got to be working towards it, though. Like, you can't just sit around with your dick in your hand, like, not doing shit. You have to be working towards it. The thing about... The thing is, bro, women get their value up front. They get all their shit up front. You know what I'm saying? Once they hit 18, bro, they good, bro. If they pretty enough... And even if they not pretty enough... Even, I've seen so many mid Jones get so many opportunities, bro, just because they female. But once a girl is 18, bro, I mean, she's pretty much giving the world. I mean, dudes hitting up, trying to trying to fly her out, invited to different parties and situations just because she's a girl. Like, she pretty much has her pick of the litter. She's in her prom. A woman is in her prom when she's, like, from 18 to her whole 20s, she's in her prom. But the thing about women is... Their prime quickly dwindles away. So if they fuck around and stay single, it's not looking too good. But once they start hitting 30, 40, it's not looking too good. Unfortunately, that's that's just how it is. I don't I don't make the rules. I just report them. But fortunately for the guys, your age like one, but you have to do the work, bro. So when you're 18, well, 16, 17, early teens to you're getting into your 20s. Hey, man, you, you might not be in your prime. You might not be getting the girls that you want to get. You might not be attracting the type of women that you want to attract. But as long as you're working and you're working towards that goal, I promise you, you will, bro. I can't, like, bro, I can't tell you how far I've gotten. And, bro, bro, y'all, what I'm about to say, y'all really need to pay attention, bro. Check me out. When you're the type of person who wants more in this world, who wants more in this life. And it's like, you, you're not going to settle for less. Like, you know what you want. You know, you know, you, you know your value in this world. You will do anything to achieve it, bro. Not anything like killing somebody or something crazy, but you will work your fucking ass off to get to where you want to be. You know what I'm saying? And that's how y'all do is need to be, bro. You need to be willing to work, 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 and grind for what you want. Like, see, bro, the problem is a lot of dudes, like, a lot of dudes, they might get rejected and they think, damn, I got rejected. Well, I guess I'll just go fuck with a three now and I'll just cuff up a three and live happily ever after and have children with a three and then I'll just be a loser. Like, no, like I knew I wanted more for myself. And I, it's a lot of other dudes who think the same way as me. I'm like, yo, if I'm getting rejected now by the caliber of girls that I want, who I think I'm, if I feel like, yo, this caliber of girl, she is beautiful. I feel like I deserve this woman. I deserve this one. We are we are on the same level. You are not above me, baby. If if see my mentality is if I get rejected by this woman, I got more work to do. I I got more work to do. I'm not gonna be like, oh well, I guess I'm uh I'm not good enough. Well, I guess I'll just go with the ugly bitches. No, I'm I, in my mind. If I get rejected by a certain caliber of woman, I'm like, all right, I got more work to do. Time to put my hair down and grind. I gotta look more attractive. I gotta get more in shape. I gotta make more money. I gotta become more confident. I said I gotta work on myself. See, when I get rejected and things don't go my way, and not even just with girls, but, you know, if I get rejected by girls, if I get rejected by a job, if I'm not getting the opportunities I want to get in life, if I'm not getting anything that I want in this life, to me, I'm not, put, I'm not putting in enough work. That's my fault. I, to me, that's a sign that I need to work harder. And what do I do? I work harder, and then I start to see the fruits of my labor. I start to see the, what I want. I'm now getting. Like, bro... Just a couple months ago, bro. Like, like I'm just, I'm just letting y'all know the power of staying down and grinding. Just a couple months ago, bro, I was down bad. I wasn't really making no money. I couldn't get a job. Like, 
I was getting curved by jumps. And it's like now, bitches be all of my... I'm getting... St I'm not trying to brag, but bro, the paper I'm getting, the bitches, I'm, it's, it's not even funny. And that's just... Bro, the situation I'm in right now versus how I was a year ago is night and day. It's night and day. The quality of women, the... the the money I'm making, everything, my confidence, everything. And this, the main point I, I want to tell y'all is that it comes from grinding. Damn, I spit up. God damn. It comes from grinding. You get what I'm saying? It comes from taking L's. It comes from, hey, listen, when it's time, when everybody else partying or when everybody else fucking around, I'm grinding. When I don't feel like it, when I come home and I'm fucking tired, I still grind. I still figure out ways to make my business successful. I sell clothes on the side. I still figure out ways, you know, what sells, what's profitable, how to scale it up. You know what I'm saying? When I don't, when I don't feel like it, but I still do it because I understand it must be done. I must grind. When I come home and I don't feel like working out, I'm tired, but I still work out. I still find a reason because I, I want more for myself. I want more in this life. And it, it just comes down to willpower, bro. If you want it bad enough, you'll get it. But to me... What helped me was I started seeing results slowly but surely. I started getting the girls I wanted. I started making the type of money I wanted. I started, I can get whatever I like. <laughs> Bro, when you start getting a taste of it, it becomes addictive. That's how it was to me. It's like, I, I just got a little taste. I'm like, damn, I can get this if I just put my head down and keep grinding? Shit, I'm finna keep grinding. And that was always my mentality, bro. And that's how, that's how I'm going to... That's how I'm going to keep going, bro. That's how I'm going to keep viewing it. If I just put my head down and I just keep grinding and do what I'm supposed to do, I can get whatever I want in this world. And that's that's the message for y'all boys. Whatever you want in this world, you can get it. But you have to work for it. Every day, you need to be working towards it. Every single day. Every day. You need to be working towards it. And I promise you, you will get it, bro. I promise you. But that's all I got for y'all today, man. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to see you on the next one, man. Peace.